Another day, another Splatoon 3 prediction going around on the internet. It hasn't even been a week since the whole July 15th release date prediction based on the tiniest and overlooked details possible. But it looks like we're diving a little bit deeper into the rabbit hole that is the release date conspiracy goldmine. So earlier today on Twitter, the Japanese Splatoon account has tweeted out their usual congratulations message to all the teams who have placed in the top four. But the most intriguing thing about this is that it doesn't say the usual the monthly league match will be held next month with details to come soon. And so so here we are, jumping on the bandwagon of predictions, and you know me, I love to predict the wackiest of things when it comes to Splatoon 3, even though I only made like one or two of these videos. Splatoon JP usually says the monthly league match will be held next month on every single one of these tweets, so it's kind of odd to leave out that specific statement unless it's to foreshadow a future Splatoon 3 test fire. I have brought this up millions of times and I'll do it again. Splat 2's test fire happened 4 months before the full game's release. So if we connect the Splatoon 3 test fire happening in March, and the July 15th release date prediction, that's a solid 4 month gap. That's almost as if they're following what they did with Splat 2. Granted, Nintendo isn't doing too hot with the whole promoting Splatoon 3's release since we still have no date except for a window. But because it's coming in the summer, and as time goes by, we will be getting more and more details on the game, and one of them is guaranteed to be a test fire. I want to mention that the Splatoon 2 test fire came out on March 14, 2017, and Splatoon 2 came out on July 21st, 2017. So, if we get a test fire this March, and the release date is predicted to be July 15th, that means the test fire will be coming either Tuesday the 8th, or Tuesday the 15th. It's a stretch of a prediction, but anything is possible at this point. And besides, Nintendo keeps shadow dropping stuff out of nowhere, just like the Kirby demo from yesterday. But if I end up being wrong, then oh well, it was a good guess. I know a lot of Splatoon fans are freaking out about this, and only time will tell to see what will happen this month and the next. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you think a test fire will happen this month? Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all again later. Bye!